Welcome to ETAP. This video will provide a quick tour to get you started with the ETAP STAR Protective Device Coordination Module. There are multiple ways to create a TCC view. One of, the one of the first ways we will discuss is a simple selection of the elements required in the coordination study, then selecting to create a STAR view. We can select to show settings or not show settings on any of the protective devices in the TCC view. And a replication of the one line diagram is created, which can be enlarged or reduced. The settings available come from the engineering libraries, which are completely verified and validated based on equipment manufacturers published data. Within each manufacturer model, different settings are available and can be selected from the one-line editor itself or from just dragging within the TCC view. Other tools are available to make doing a coordination study easier. You can zoom in to a new window and the zoom window dynamically updates as you drag it across your TCC study. Or find the time difference between any two curves and drag that dynamically adjusting the time difference. And if you want the specific time and current at any point on the curve, select the curve and bring in a crosshair to give you the exact time and current at any point. The crosshair can also be brought into any area within the TCC view. Use the plot options to customize the look and feel of your TCC study. Here you can change the look of any, you can change the look and color of any TCC curve within the study. Also, for the label settings, use the label setting editor to edit any of the parameters you want to show within the setting data block. And within the devices tab, you can select to show the ground and the phase within the same TCC study. Switch to ground mode to view the phase and ground functions together on the same coordination study. Now that we've looked at some of the features within the TCC study, let's look at another tool of helping create one. Utilize the path detection tool to automatically identify and define a protection coordination path. This tool allows you to select an element while automatically the zones required. From here, you can create star TCC views from the zones selected by creating a view per zone, a single view, or an append to an existing one. Expanding a zone identifies all the equipment that has been selected. Then you use sequence of operation to determine the operating time of the, of the protective devices and graphically animate the sequence in which your devices would trip. The sequence of operation output report displays the through fault and the operating time of the protective device. Then when it's time to validate your coordination study, use the STAR Auto module, which automatically detects and evaluates system protection and coordination based on customized de design criteria and industry guidance. STAR Auto intelligently detects protection zones, calculates through fault currents, and evaluates for system protection and coordination. Select from different devices, view the TCC, and detect violations and concerns of equipment protection and device coordination for possible correction and adjustments of protective device settings. Adjust the settings directly from the STAR Auto TCC view and automatically update the results of the evaluation. And when your project is complete, Select from a list of reports to provide as deliver deliverables to the client. You can export the STAR Auto results to Excel or just print device settings reports. The device settings reports provide detailed information of all the parameters that were utilized in your project. Thank you for watching this video on how to get started with ETEP STAR. We look forward to working with you.